you guys it's tuesday morning welcome back to the channel if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe right now it's a new year's it's uh january 2nd and uh, i'm leaving the yard and my brother's backing up to the trailer right now in the other truck the brown truck and i'm gonna have to try to find him a load right now but me i'm bobtailing to lathrop california which is like 90 miles from where i'm at right now oh gotta put on my seatbelt. So I'm bobtailing to 90 miles from where I'm at right now. And we're gonna be doing a load from Lathrop to Hermiston, Oregon. And then we'll probably be getting a load back. So heading to Lathrop right now. Gotta get there ASAP. And then right now I gotta find my brother a load. All right, so we're here at our pickup. Gonna go check in and see what they tell me. This is a Clorox place right here. Okay, so we're in the process of loading that one. We didn't have the trailer for it. Okay. So someone just dropped drop one. So if you want to drop your empty and wait for this load. Okay. All right, let's see. Yeah, so I guess they're not done loading the trailer yet. So we're going to have to sit here and wait. All right, so once they're done loading this trailer, we're going to be connecting to it. But I was checking out the trailer. It's an older trailer. Everything looks good besides this tire. That one right there. But still drivable, I guess. Yeah, but I ordered these over the weekend, these lug nut covers. Looks cool. A little bit better. Because it, it didn't have any. So we're all loaded up. Time to close these doors. Yeah, so I, I don't know if I mentioned before, but this is a Clorox load. Uh, we have those Clorox wipes in the back. It's, we're going to the Walmart in Hermiston, Oregon. Been there plenty of times. I know exactly how it works, but so far 2024, starting off pretty decent to be honest. We found a load for both trucks and uh, the rate was about what they're paying right now between 250 to three dollars a mile maybe a little bit lower is what they're kind of paying right now but anything above three dollars a mile is, is probably like a blessing right now <laughs> there's considered kind of really good not kind of but it's considered really good right now it's not like how it was back then when you would get those uh seven dollar eight dollar a mile loads back in 2020 21 <laughs> miss those days hey what if that happens this year though what if it goes what if everything starts getting better that will be amazing oh i don't know i think i might catch some snow today because today i'm not gonna be on the i-5 i'm gonna be on the east side of oregon so i'm gonna hit the 97 and that's more on the east side so and it's usually colder on that side so I might run into to some snow. We'll see though. Good thing I got my chains. I got, I got everything I need. But do I really feel like chaining up? No. But if I have to, we got to do what we got to do. But on my last video, I was trolling you guys and I said that, because my brother was like, oh, starting the new year, I'm gonna get paid 35 cents a mile. But we were just trolling you guys that he gets paid 30 cents a mile. He doesn't. He gets paid more than that. We're just trolling. And I hope, hopefully you guys know that I'm trolling when I say real truckers wear flip-flops because I'm obviously just lying and playing around. But some of y'all can't take a joke. Can't even joke around on here, man. You got a problem? Huh? <laughs> but anyways... Got my coffee right here. Today I got a venti salted cream cold brew. Venti. That means the biggest one that they have. Cheers, mother truckers. Ah, we're gonna be using our hall clock today, so I might need a another coffee later on or an energy drink because yeah, 
it's gonna be a long one. We're gonna use all of our 13 hours or 14 hours. Woo! But I mentally prepared myself and I already had like three days off, so it should be nothing. So we got a little bit of snow. It's like snow, but when it falls, it just turns into water. It's not cold enough yet. It's only 35. But if it was colder, it'll definitely be snow right now on the ground and everywhere. You guys can't really you guys can't really tell over the video though or over the camera. Alright, so we're here in Klamath Falls, Oregon. Stop to get something to eat some stuff away. And uh yeah, still having problems with my headlights. Now both of them are off, but I changed out one of the bulbs so it started working again on the driver's side. And then the passenger side is just always off, so. Man, I think this week, cause last time I took it to the mechanic, they couldn't find anything wrong, but it was like, one of those mechanics that only really works on like brakes, tires. So uh, this week, and I'm just, cause since I'm going on vacation, I'm probably just gonna have to take it to like a Kenworth or a real mechanic. All right, so we have used all of our clock. It's time for us to find somewhere to park and call it a night. Oh, right here. Oh, perfect. Good morning, you guys. Seven in the morning. We got three hours to go. We'll be there around 10, 10, 15. Right now I'm going up this mountain, so I'm going like 20 miles per hour. It's a little cold out here, a little bit of snow, nothing too bad. But yeah, my, my brother, he made his delivery this morning in Mira Loma at the Costco. But he texted me right now saying that he got a parking ticket, so that kind of sucks. I've been there a lot of times and I never got a ticket. So I'm kind of wondering where he parked. I'm gonna tell him to send me a picture. in Oregon. Time to get this damn trailer off my truck. Left lane, Walmart trucks only. Right lane, over the road trucks. All right. All righty. All right. All righty. All right, let me put on my shoes. I don't want to wear my flip-flops out here. So we're all checked in. They just told us to come drop the trailer over here in section M1. So it's going to be all the way over here and then to our right. Got to get out and look. See how I'm doing. Okay, it's going in there pretty good. Can I get it? Here you go. straighten out a little bit it should be good easy peasy lemon squeezy 
Easy peasy lemon squeezy. My thing right here, and look, it's all it was all filled with water. Except I tried to get the water out, but then I saw there was a bunch of dirt in there. So I don't want to put this in there, because then all that dirt's gonna get in there. So now I have to try to clean it out with the screwdriver and get everything out of there. Cause I don't want to leave it somewhere on here, cause it's just gonna hang loose like that, and then it's gonna break or something. So now I'm looking for an empty, but I've already found three. One was. But the first two ones that I saw, they're just really, really close to other trailers. So I was like, you know what, I'll look for another one. And then the third one I saw is really low to the ground. And then here's another one right here. All right, so I don't know if I mentioned this, but we got all connected to the trailer. Uh, so we're heading to Weed, California. I got the bypass, there's a scale house right here. I used a DriveWise app and it gave me the bypass, so. We all good in the hood. Yeah, so we'll probably get to weed like around, I want to say eight, nine-ish. So I'm going to see if there's a Planet, oh, there actually is a Planet Fitness over here in Bend, Oregon. I'm going to get a workout in because all these holidays and all this drinking I've been doing on the weekends is starting to get a little fat for my face and a little gut again. I gotta start putting this work in. My arms feel bigger, but it's because I'm getting fatter too.